Wardens, we are betrayed by the very world we have sworn to protect. The Inquisition is inside, Clarel. We have no time to stand on ceremony. These men and women are giving their lives, Magister. That might mean little in Tavinta, but for the Wardens, it is a sacred duty. It has been many long years, my friend. Too many, Clarel. If my sword arm can no longer serve the Wardens, then my blood will have to do. It will. Stop them! We must complete the ritual! Clarelle, if you complete that ritual, you're doing exactly what Eremond wants. What? Fighting the Blight? Keeping the world safe from Darkspawn? Who wouldn't want that? And yes, the ritual requires blood sacrifice. Hate me for that if you must, but do not hate the Wardens for doing their duty! We make the sacrifices no one else will. Our warriors die proudly for a world that will never thank them. And then he binds your mages to Corypheus. Corypheus? But he's dead. These people will say anything to shake your confidence, Clarell. Bring it through! see more than my share of blood magic. It is never worth the cost. I helped fight the Archdemon in Ferelden. Could you consider listening to me? Be ready with the ritual, Clarell. This demon is truly worthy of your strength. Listen to me! I have no quarrel with the Wardens. I have spared those I could. I don't want to kill you, but you're being used. And some of you know it, don't you? The mages who've done the ritual? They're not right. They were my friends, but now they're like puppets on a string. You cannot let fear sway your mind, Warden Chernoff. He's not afraid. You are. You're afraid that you ordered all these brave men and women to die for nothing. If this were a fight against future blights, I would be at your side. But it's a lie! Clarell, we have come so far. You're the only one who can do this. Perhaps we could test the truth of these charges to avoid more bloodshed. Perhaps I should bring in a more reliable ally. My master thought you might come here, Inquisitor. He sent me this to welcome you.
You've destroyed the Grey Wardens. <laughs> you did that to yourself, you stupid bitch. All I did was dangle a little power before your eyes, and you couldn't wait to get your hands bloody. God. I will never serve the Blight! Uh, well, this is unexpected. We, we were falling. Is this... Are we dead? No. This is the Fade. The Inquisitor opened a rift. We came through, and survived. I never thought I would ever find myself here physically. Look, the Black City, almost close enough to touch. This must be very exciting for you, Solus. Any advice you have on what exactly is going on would be wonderful. What spirit commands this place? I have never seen anywhere like it. That's not how I remember the Fade either. Perhaps it's because we're here physically, instead of just dreaming. The stories say you walked out of the Fade at Haven. Was it like this? I don't know. I still can't remember what happened the last time I did this. Well, whatever happened at Haven, we can't assume we're safe now. That huge demon was right on the other side of that rift Aramant was using, and there could be others. In the real world, the rift with the demons in it was nearby. In the main hall. Can we get out the same way? It sounds like our best option. There. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> 